A right circular cylinder has radius 3 and height 3. If A and B are two points on its surface, what is the maximum possible straight line distance between A and B? Let's go ahead and sketch out a cylinder here. Looks something like this. Not great, but serves its purpose. So we have two points A and B that are on the surface of this thing, and we want to know basically what's the maximum distance between them. So first we need to figure out what points will give us that maximum distance. And here are two points, and that's, you know, pretty long distance. That'll actually be the height of three, which is, of course, not an answer here. So is there something else? Well, notice if I pick this point over here, and I pick this point over here, and I connect them, that's going to be my longest straight line distance in this cylinder. Now, how do I find that distance? Well, I know that the radius is 3, so it means the diameter of the circle is 6. And I know the height of the circle is 3. Height of this, excuse me, cylinder is 3. And now I can Pythagorean theorem, because it's just going to be 6 squared plus 3 squared equals AB squared. So 6 squared plus 3 squared plus AB squared. And let's go ahead and calculate this. So it's going to be 36 plus 9 which is 45, and then we'll square root it, and we get 6.71, and unfortunately none of our answers are in terms of that, so we can either plug these into the calculator, we know it's not 6, uh, we can try 3 square root of 3, 3, so we can plug them into the calculator, see which one matches, not quite, how about 3 square root of 5? 3 squared of 6, actually, let's try that. Uh, not quite. So 3 squared of 5 it is. So there it is, it's 3 squared of 5. So we can manage it that way, or we could have done it by hand originally. So we got AB squared equals 45, which means AB is the square root of 45, and the square root of 45 is the same thing as the square root of 9 times 5. This 9, square root of 9 is 3, so that comes out as a 3 and we've got the square root of 5 left. So you could do it that way as well. Either way, this one is B.